Yo, what's up, guys, and welcome into a new Phasmophobia Tier 3 video. I have reached level 96 already, and I've unlocked all Tier 3 items. So in this video, I'm going to show you all of them, how they can be used, and what they feel like. I hope you're joining me for that, but let's not waste any more time, and let's hop right into this video. Let's start with the base evidence items. The Tier 3 video camera is a large cinematic camera that has a really high resolution. It has by far the biggest screen out of all of them, which makes it really easy to spot ghost orbs. It also has the least amount of paranormal interference during ghost events. The second item is the DOTS Tier 3. It is best mounted on a wall which makes it really easy to cover the entire room with DOTS. It has a 7 meter range and pans left to right which makes it really easy to see the DOTS. As for all the other tiers, you can also snap a photo of the ghost during the dots. And the photo will count as a full-fledged ghost photo. The third item is the EMF tier 3. It has a 3.5 meter range compared to the 1.7 meters of the previous tiers. It has a very high accuracy, an audio indicator, a display screen and a distance indicator and a directional indicator. It can display up to 3 EMFs at a time. The newest one will always come up at the bottom. This item is even super useful if you want to spot special abilities like the pot Geist multi throw. If you see an event like that, your screen will be packed with EMFs. The bars at the top of each EMF showcase the level of the EMF you got. So if you get all five bars, you have an EMF 5 evidence. Bottom left, it shows the distance in meters to the EMF, and on the right side, it shows the direction where it happened. The direction will also change as you turn your player character. The tier 3 writing book is a very heavy book that has the highest range of them all of 5 meters. It also has the highest interaction rate with the ghost so it should be very easy to get the ghost writing evidence with this book. The tier 3 spirit box is a large spirit box that is capable of scanning two frequency channels at a time. The audio quality is also very high and the response rate is the highest it can go. So with this spirit box it should be very easy to get the spirit box evidence. The range of this thing is so large you can even easily use it during a hunt looping the ghost. Are you here? Close to a bustling Where are you? Behind us. How old are you? Out of the the tier 3 thermometer is a very modern device that is known for its high accuracy. It has the highest sample speed possible so it's very fast on gathering those temperatures. The tier 3 UV light has a very wide spotlight. You can literally use this thing as a flashlight replacement. It also has the shortest UV charge time of 1.5. If you didn't know already, you need to charge the fingerprints now with the UV light if you want to take a picture of them. The longer you charge the fingerprints or footprints, the longer they stay. And this tier 3 UV will do this in record time. The tier 3 flashlight is a flashlight with the highest intensity. It also has the widest angle, so it should be very easy to navigate around with this flashlight. The tier 3 firelight you have is a lantern. This lantern will never go out unless the ghost is blowing it out. It has a 2 meter range and it is also waterproof. It will also reduce the passive sanity drain in the house by 66%. It will also reduce the passive sanity drain if you're placing it on the floor and standing within 2 meters. 
The tier 3 lighter is a very fancy lighter that is waterproof. So you can even use this item in the rain. It also lasts for 10 minutes compared to the 5 minutes of the tier 2. The tier 3 tripod is a small advancement from the tier 2. It also allows you to pan around the camera in the truck. But this version is much sturdier than the previous one, so the ghost has a harder time to knock it over. The tier 3 sound sensor has expensive shotgun microphones attached. It has three different ranges from 5, 10 to 15 meters. If you click on it, it also provides three different sensor shapes. One of them is a circle, one of them is a cone, and one of them are just two sides. You can change the size of the sensors in the truck by clicking on this icon here. And you're also able to hear the sounds that it is picking up in the truck. This sound sensor, just like the other sound sensors, can only track one floor. The tier 3 photo camera is an SLR camera that has a larger screen. It has medium paranormal interference and it can take a large amount of photos in a short amount of time. The tier 3 sanity medication is basically an adrenaline shot. It has the shortest sanity restoration speed of 10 seconds. The best thing about this shot though is the sprint boost. You will get an extra 10 seconds of sprinting. So if you haven't used your sprint yet, you can run for 13 seconds. Make sure to remember that you can only use this shot if you are below 95% sanity. The tier 3 salt is black salt that you can use 3 times. If the ghost walks into this salt, if it's not haunting, it will just go back to the place where it started walking. So you can use this salt to keep the ghost in a room. If the ghost walks into the salt during a hunt, it will slow it down significantly by about 1 to 2 seconds. It seems like this effect doesn't stack, so you have to spread out the salt piles. The ghost will even leave UV light footprints if it walks into the salt during a hunt. Paramic Tier 3 is a high quality microphone with a screen. It also has a 30 meter range but a much wider cone where you can track stuff. It will also muffle all the sounds around you just like the other Paramics. But the cool thing about this thing is that it has a distance indicator. And the objects on the screen that it notices even move as you move. It also shows you the decibels of the noise. And you can even use this thing to see the ghost during a hunt on the screen. Tier 3 smudge is an incense burner. It will burn for 7 seconds instead of 6 seconds for the tier 2. The best thing about this device though is that it will hold the ghost during the hunt for a few seconds. I highly recommend to not crouch with this device though because it has a weird effect on your movement. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
<laughs> the tier 3 headcam is a pure gem. If you long press your special key or long press T on your keyboard, you will get night vision with this device. Make sure to remember that this device is an electronic so the ghost can track it as long as you have the night vision on. The tier 3 motion sensor is a security camera that was stripped apart. It has a circle scan range and a light indicator. Every time the ghost steps into that circle, the camera will turn towards the ghost, it will make a sound and also a flash. The best thing about this device is though that the player cannot trigger it, only the ghost. The tier 3 crucifix is the fanciest of them all. It has a larger 5 meter range and also two uses. But it also has a special ability to prevent one cursed hunt. So you can use this to safely get the ghost photo with either the music box or the summoning circle. Or any other cursed hunt that you trigger with the other cursed possessions. <laughs> And this was it with all the tier 3 items. Let me know in the comments if this was helpful. Thank you so much guys for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Oh, all these patrons. Thank you so much guys for your support. Mwah. Big schmutz. Mm-hmm.